countervail, to offset, counting house, a house or office used for transacting business, bookkeeping, correspondence, etc. Countryman, a rustic. Courageous, brave. Course, line of motion or direction. Courser, a fleet and spirited horse. Courtesy, politeness originating in kindness and exercised habitually. Covenant, an agreement entered into by two or more persons or parties. Covert, concealed, especially for an evil purpose. Covey, a flock of quails or partridges. Cower, to crouch down tremblingly, as through fear or shame. Toxwain, one who steers a rowboat, or one who has charge of a ship's boat and its crew under an officer. Crag, a rugged, rocky projection on a cliff or ledge. Cranium, the skull of an animal, especially that part enclosing the brain. Crass, coarse or thick in nature or structure, as opposed to thin or fine. Craving, a vehement desire. Creak, a sharp, harsh, squeaking sound. Creamery, a butter-making establishment. Creamy, resembling or containing cream. Credence, belief. Credible, believable. Credulous, easily deceived. Creed, a formal summary of fundamental points of religious belief. Crematory, a place for cremating dead bodies. Crevasse, a deep crack or fissure in the ice of a glacier. Crevice, a small fissure as between two contiguous surfaces. Criterion, a standard by which to determine the correctness of a judgment or conclusion. Critique, a criticism or critical review. Crockery, earthenware made from baked clay. Crucible, a trying and purifying test or agency. Crusade, any concerted movement vigorously prosecuted in behalf of an idea or principle. Crustacean, pertaining to a division of arthropods containing lobsters, crabs, crawfish, etc. Crustaceous, having a crust-like shell. Cryptogram, anything written in characters that are secret or so arranged as to have hidden meaning. Crystallize, to bring together or give fixed shape to. Cudgel, a short, thick stick used as a club. Culinary, of or pertaining to cooking or the kitchen. Cull, to pick or sort out from the rest. Culpable, guilty. Culprit, a guilty person. Culvert, any artificial covered channel for the passage of water through a bank or under a road canal. Cupidity, avarice. Curable, capable of being remedied or corrected. Curator, a person having charge as of a library or museum. Curio, a piece of bric-a-brac. Cursive, writing in which the letters are joined together. Cursory, rapid and superficial. Curt, Concise, compressed, and abrupt in act or expression. Curtail, to cut off or cut short. Curtsy, a downward movement of the body by bending the knees. Cycloid, like a circle. Signet, a young swan. Cynical, exhibiting moral skepticism. Cynicism, contempt for the opinions of others and of what others value. Sinisure, that to which general interest or attention is directed. Daring, brave. Darkling, blindly. Darwinism, the doctrine that natural selection has been the prime cause of evolution of higher forms. Dastard, a base coward. Datum, a premise, starting point, or given fact. Dauntless, Fearless. 
Daemon, a day laborer. Dead heat, a race in which two or more competitors come out even and there is no winner. Dearth, scarcity as of something customary, essential or desirable. Death's head, a human skull as a symbol of death. Debase, to lower in character or virtue. Debatable, subject to contention or dispute. Debonair, having gentle or courteous bearing or manner. Debut, a first appearance in society or on the stage. Decagon, a figure with ten sides and ten angles. Decagram, a weight of ten grams. Decaliter, a liquid and dry measure of ten liters. Decalogue, the Ten Commandments. Decent, characterized by propriety of conduct, speech, manners, or dress. Deciduous, falling off at maturity as petals after flowering, fruit when ripe, etc. Decimal, founded on the number ten. Decimate, to destroy a measurable or large proportion of. Decipher. To find out the true words or meaning of, as something hardly legible. Decisive. Conclusive. Declamation. A speech recited or intended for recitation from memory in public. Declamatory. A full and formal style of utterance. Declarative. Containing a formal, positive, or explicit statement or affirmation. Declension. The change of endings in nouns and adjectives to express their different relations of gender. Decorate. To embellish. Decorous. Suitable for the occasion or circumstances. Decoy. Anything that allures or is intended to allure into danger or temptation. Decrepit. Enfeebled as by old age or some chronic infirmity. Dedication. The voluntary consecration or relinquishment of something to an end or cause. Deduce. To derive or draw as a conclusion by reasoning from given premises or principles. Deface. To mar or disfigure the face or external surface of. Defalcate. To cut off or take away as a part of something. Defamation. Malicious and groundless injury done to the reputation or good name of another. Defame. To slander. Default. The neglect or omission of a legal requirement. Defendant. A person against whom a suit is brought. Defensible. Capable of being maintained or justified. Defensive. Carried on in resistance to aggression. Defer. To delay or put off to some other time. Deference. Respectful submission or yielding as to another's opinion, wishes, or judgment. Defiant. Characterized by bold or insolent opposition. Deficiency. Lack or insufficiency. Deficient. Not having an adequate or proper supply or amount. Definite. Having an exact signification or positive meaning. Deflect. To cause to turn aside or downward. Deforest. To clear of forests. Deform. To disfigure. Deformity. A disfigurement. Defraud. To deprive of something dishonestly.